talk about the January 6th insurrection. I'm wondering, do you keep cable TV on? Uh, no, never. But I got a uh, text message from one of my staff folks told me well, there was a problem at the Capitol, so I turned on the TV. I watched it for about an hour. Turned it off. Couldn't stand to watch it anymore. It's awful. I mean, it's incomprehensible to me to believe this really happened. I, I just couldn't hardly believe it. Do you think President Trump bears responsibility? I do, I do. And I don't think it was just about him showing up at a rally on, the, on January 6th. Uh, the comments that were made all summer about the election was gonna be stolen from him, all the noise that occurred after the election. I kept looking for facts, except I never saw them. Here's all these people loyal to Donald Trump, and he abused them. He, he stepped all over their loyalty to him by continuing to say things that just weren't true. Your staff told me that you wrote an email to what they call Boehner World, I guess. Boehnerland. Boehnerland. That's what my staff calls our team. I sent uh, an email to Boehnerland to express my dismay at, uh, at what happened and talk to them about all of us as Americans, the need to, to stand up. I also said that uh, it's time for Republicans to wake up. Uh, the nap has turned into a nightmare. And I suggested that I would raise my voice, and they should raise their voices too in terms of, of acting like Republicans. And so that's the essence uh, of what I said. What kind of response did you get to the email? Oh, dozens and dozens of emails from our former team members uh, who were grateful that I uh, sent the email, grateful that I was reaching out, helping set some path forward uh, for all of us. Did, how powerful does Trump continue to be in the party? Well, there's clearly uh, you know, some number of, uh, of what I'll call Trump Republicans who still uh, think he walks on water. And here's the guy that's unemployed with nothing better to do. <laughs> and so anybody thinks he's going to go away, uh, that's probably not going to happen until he finds something better to do with himself. Hey, thanks for watching. If you like this video, check out these other videos from USA Today to stay up to date with all the latest news.